Alzheimer's affects twice as many women as it does men. So are you only studying male mice? Of course. You put a few female mice in a cage and pretty soon you have a whole social hierarchy. The young ones are taking care of the oldest and they experience anxiety and stress, sometimes resulting in hair loss, and their hormone cycles create fluctuations in behavior that can render the whole experiment useless. Your inexperience in neurology research is showing great. Anyone in this field of study knows hmm, female mice are problematic. Right? So you're not studying female mice because their reproductive systems mess with your results? Catch on quick. That's pathetic. And the most asinine excuse for sexism I've ever heard. No wonder no one's ever cured Alzheimer's. The men who have spent decades trying to do it have ignored the patients who need it the most. And what's worst of all is no one in this room seems interested in changing any of it. How can we let this happen knowing it directly affects us? Well, thank you all for your time.